Now we're right here in the thick of things yeah. with the Dakota engines going in the background yeah. and you've brought along a pair of old boots and it isn't often I get to value a pair of old boots on the roadshow. Why have you brought no. them with you? Well they were the boots that my husband was wearing when he had to bail out of the Vulcan aeroplane because it caught fire. What was he doing? He was the navigator plotter and they'd finished their exercise and were returning to base when it caught fire over the North Sea. But they were able to get onto good old Lincolnshire soil and they were the first thing of his body to touch the ground in Lincolnshire. Isn't Those that fantastic? Boots, yeah. Still got a bit of soil underneath us. Uh, probably, yes. And what's this next to you? Yeah, this is the handle of the parachute that he had to pull for his escape. And afterwards, the men in the workshop at RAF Waddington put it onto this little plinth as a memento of that day, the 17th of January, 1977. Well, the Vulcan yeah. bombers, of course, were really uh, part of our frontline force mm -hmm. during the Cold War Correct. to protect us yeah. from the perceived Soviet enemy, yes. if you like. Yes. And he started his career here in RAF Coningsby. Did he? Mm. And what about this very crude picture yeah. here? Tell me all about that. I love this picture. When he landed um, near Spilsby, he was rescued by a farmer. And the farmer took him to his farmhouse. Because he'd hurt his neck, they lay him in front of the Arga cooker in the warm, because it was January. And when his little son came in from school, here's this man lying on the floor in front of the Arga. And he drew this picture, a little boy, Richard. It must have been a marvelous day for him. And he sent it to the mess at RAF Waddington yeah. with the get well message on, which Good I've grief. treasured all these years. <laughs> I've spoken to him since, and uh, I made contact with him and took him a picture of the Vulcan. Uh, as a, a reminder. And do you know what? Thing. I find this very moving, actually. Uh, really well, do. it's a lovely story. It's more marvellous that they all five of them got out of the plane. Yes. They yeah. didn't always hold. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Did he ever fly again? No. Why not? Uh, he was invalided out after that. Right. Yeah. Well, you know, this is the time when I come to say what these things are worth. Yes. And I've got to say, you presented me with a bit of a problem here, because what are a pair of old boots worth? Yes. Not very much, not very to be much. honest with you. The handle from a parachute, not yeah. very much. Yeah. A child's drawing, yeah. not very much. Mm. So from a commercial point of view, uh -huh. the value is negligible. Probably not even £20. No. But from your point of view, they are priceless. Yes.